Assalamu alaikum guys and welcome to another episode of Smile to Jannah Yes, that's right I don't think many of you guys understand the struggles of people with glasses who have to wear the mask Smile to Jannah Obligating little girls to wear skirts and if they don't, taking them to court No, we're not living in United Pedo land this is actually taking place here in the United Kingdom. Where are the Tommy Robinsons? I've changed what I'm saying. Where are the people who stand up for the rights yeah. of the students, of the people? Nowhere to be heard, frankly. This is what happens when you give perverts too much power. Mm. That must be watching. You know what? I've never got my head around the fact how they're able to send their girls to school in skirts and boys in trousers. How have Ofsted never gone Hang on a minute guys, this is just weird. In an era where genders are more fluid than my post biryani toilet, <coughs> it seems that Muslim girls are still being pushed to expose themselves to get a decent education. Where are these feminists that we speak of? Where are these alphabet people? You know who I mean. Those people that took 20% of the alphabet for themselves. Why are they not speaking up against this? Mm, to be honest, I don't know. Hey, if you want to know what a fraction is, I want to wanna see some leg. Uh, okay sir, would you like some wings and some chips as well? Yes boss man, and if you can give me some extra chili sauce, as long as I don't have to pay an extra 20p because you see, that's where I draw the line. In an era where preserving one's modesty is becoming more difficult than Boris following his own rules during a lockdown. I mean here you have a sister who embraced Islam and she noticed the change in the way that people approached her in the first couple of years and in the end she, she had to take it off because she just couldn't manage. We pray of course Allah makes it easy for her but it just goes to show how being clothed and being modest is more difficult than exposing yourself. Yeah, and exposing your kids. I see seven year old girls walking with pants this big, mate, with their dad and their brother. What the hell is this? <laughs> like it's normal. So when you've got little girls that want to add a few more centimeters to their dress, so they don't feel like objects. Let's focus on empowering and supporting them rather than bullying their family, scarring them for life and berating them in public. I mean you guys are a school for God's sake. As long as students have a valid reason and what could be a more valid reason than a girl just wanting to cover herself up? It's mind boggling mate. Let's leave it there guys until next time. Long live the queen. I mean, as long as it's decreed for her, obviously, isn't it? And oh yeah, salam alaikum.